Tom, what a frustrating afternoon for a Bristol Rovers player. Yeah, it's a um, frustrating day, um, especially losing as well. And um, I think that we played um, really well today, like kept the ball well and um, created a few chances. But um, fair dues to them, they scored a great goal. Um, I'll give them that. But um, I think on the day we did, we did deserve something out of the game. How did the game change for you once Holly Clark is sent off? It's difficult. Um, we've had to change in shape. We had to go from a three into a four, and um, I think like when we was playing a three, we um, we had a lot of possession. We, I think down the left hand side and right side, we had a lot of time and and um, space to get into, and I think that um, it was hurting them. But um, as you say, like since sending off, um, we had to change formation. You know, Ollie Clark. Um, it does an elbow or a, a straight red in that situation sound like Ollie Clark to you? No, Ollie Clark's a, a tough tackling player. He, he's not going to back out of a challenge. From where I was standing, it looked like he was just two players going for a header. So I can't really say anything about it. Um, but to me, it looked like they, they both just went for the header. And, and whatever the referee's seen, the referee's seen. Did you see anything of Billy Bowden's tumble in the box right at the end there? I've, um, at, 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 on the, in the game, I actually thought it was a penalty. Um, but like again, like you say... It's a referee's decision, but um, personally, I think it was a penalty. But it's one of them days, ain't it? Yeah. Um, Bristol Rovers certainly gave Oxford a good game with ten or eleven um, today. I mean, you're settling to life in League One, pretty uh, League Two, pretty well, aren't you? Yeah, I think um, we've settled in really well. Um, disappointed with two defeats on the back on the back of each other, but um, we've got a team that's got the. Um, momentum to bounce back from that and um, hopefully we get another win next week um, but like you say we, we're settled into this league uh, I know it's difficult to say but would you have taken three wins and three defeats from six? Um, possibly because it's, um, it's we've had three great wins two away so that's massive achievement for us as well but um, I think after last week it was disappointing against Leighton Orient and I think today we've shown that we can bounce back from it, and we, we played a lot better today. Um, but it's just disappointing that we didn't get anything out of the game. But I think when you say we, we took three wins out of six games, um, not really. I would rather take six out of six. <laughs> but now um, I think we should be pleased with what we've done, especially coming straight back up from last season. I think, did the header at right at the end fall to you? Yeah, so, um, at the time I, f I felt like I should have got a little bit more onto it. Um, but it was, it was just happening so quick and, and I probably just took my, my eye off it a little bit and a little bit of concentration and that was all. It felt like a niggly game watching it, plenty going on all over the pitch. Did it feel like that on it? Um, I don't know really. Um, I think as a team like there were a lot of fouls going so I think that's one thing that was going off in the game but uh, it's difficult really to say what, what went off like with everything today. But um in my my opinion as well, I think like we just gotta to stick to our own game and not worry about anything else. Accrington next. Um it'll be a game which I think you might be even be expected to win so such so well as you're doing. Would that be fair? Um fans oh I think a lot of fans will expect us to win because we're at home again. Um but we we've just gotta concentrate on working hard this week in training getting things sorted right and then coming out on Saturday and, and putting another good performance in and I think if we do that then hopefully we've got a better chance of getting three points. Thick and fast this league isn't it? You're not wrong <laughs> but um, we've just got to make sure that we we recover right now from today's game make sure that we we work hard in training and then when we come to Saturday hopefully we can go out and get them three points that we need.